What's going on YouTube? I'm back with another video. Today, opening up the Collectible Card Club Basketball Box for July. Uh, if you do not know about the Collectible Card Club, it's a subscription box where they send uh, packs to your doorstep. Now, there's different levels of the collection uh, with different price points, as well as you can get uh, current or you can get vintage or hybrid where you get the, uh, the newer packs as well as some of the older. Uh, this particular box here is a hybrid box, so it has both the older stuff and some of the newer stuff. Went ahead and already opened it up, so let's see what I got. Let these uh, packing peanuts out of the way. I already see one pack that I'm very excited about uh, here, the 1989 basketball that is Fleer. As you expect, there's some 89 hoops uh, oh, cool. 92, 93 Tops Stadium Club Series 1. Uh, Panini Contenders 2011-2012 NBA Hoops. Excited about this pack. 91-92 Fleer Basketball. Uh, especially if I were to get the Dikembe Mutombo autograph. Uh, I like Mutombo. He's in my PC. Press Pass 2004. Some Donruss. Uh, Skybox, the inaugural year. This is 90-91. And then what year is that? Oh, 91-92 uh, Upper Deck. And finally, we have Prestige Hoops Flare Ultra Series 2. Shaq Rookie Potential Contenders and McDonald's NBA Fantasy Pack. So these, if I remember, were sold at McDonald's back in 1993 for, uh, uh, I think it was 99 cents. What if I won the one-on-one -on -one with Michael Jordan? I wonder if they'd still honor that. Probably not. Well, let's go ahead and get ripping. Hope you all doing well out there. I hope you're finding some packs out in the wild. Uh, I know that basketball packs are extremely difficult to find around here. So really like these repack boxes, uh, you know, especially since I don't have an LCS anywhere nearby. Helps me build my collection, and I get to open up uh, a lot of different fun packs. So let's get rid of the press pass first. Uh, not expecting much from this pack. Um, probably a lot of names of, of guys that I don't remember or have never heard of. Filler card. Uh, J.R. Smith, big numbers. Nice die cut, kind of cool looking card. And Kirk Snyder. Uh, let's go ahead and open up this 91-92 Upper Deck, the inaugural year when I was really collecting cards quite heavily as a kid. I remember this stuff. Uh, if I remember correctly, um, you wanted to get the LJ, Larry Johnson rookie, or of course I was looking for the Matumbo rookie uh, with the Denver Skyline in the background. Uh, this pack does not want to open up. There we go. Uh, I remember there were a few inserts as well in these. Um, let's see. One thing about these upper decks is how they uh, <laughs> put them in the packs. I remember they were always flipped over. So, Vinnie Johnson. Now, that is cool. Michael Jordan hologram right there. It's probably one of the better inserts that you could have pulled from this uh, pack. But, uh, wow, right on, right on. I will happily add one of those to my collection. Those were sweet cards. I remember those back in the day, uh, very collectible and you could easily trade those. Uh, check out how young Steve Kerr is right there. That's kind of cool. And speaking of Steve Kerr, obviously uh, the Distribution was not the best in Upper Deck's earlier years. Excuse my cat in the background. Actually, my wife's cat. And uh, running up back, Lionel Simmons. Uh, let's go ahead and go into this 89 Hoops, uh, the chase card back in the day. Now, I do believe this was the updated series here, this pack. So probably won't get the Admiral Rookie card, but there was a second David Robinson card that was added. Um, but uh, I remember everybody was chasing that uh, championship card of the Detroit Pistons. 
That's a nice Larry Bird. These were fun cards to collect. I really enjoyed these cards. Just kind of have a clean background to them. Hey, there's the worm. Man, look at his head up almost to the rim. That is a nice, that is a cool card. Chuck Daly and Frank Johnson. Ah, so next, let's, uh, you know, I want to open up this McDonald's pack. Uh, obviously, you want the Michael Jordan out of here. Everything from back then, Michael Jordan. I think if I remember correctly, there were three cards per pack. And, uh, hey, there's Shaquille O'Neal right off the top. I was just going to say, I believe there was a few Shaq cards in there, or a Shaq card, but uh, here you go, Shaquille O'Neal. Uh, this is one of the more popular cards back in the day uh, on the, those first Shaq, those first releases. Christian Leitner from Duke and Clyde the Glide Drexler. Had a very great career. I used to enjoy watching him play. Uh, next, let's open up one of these contenders draft picks. This is back from 2015. Uh, Carl Anthony Towns, probably one of your bigger cards. D'Angelo Russell in there. Uh, I don't remember ever opening up any of this, so not really sure. Maybe some inserts or parallels. I'm sure there's an autograph. Um, at least the opportunity at autograph. So, white side, cover, Jabari Brown. Hey, there's Kyrie, Duke. And Trey Burke, okay. I, w I really wanna open up, we'll save that. I will, well, let's open up the 16 contenders. Stay with the contenders theme. So do you like these uh, repack products? I like the Brothers in Cards, and this is uh, the Collectible Card Club. It's something new that I've been purchasing, and just I enjoy it. I like the mix of cards, like the mix of the older with the newer, and the price point is really good. Uh, if I remember correctly, 15 packs for about $60 shipped, and it's a good mix of packs. A lot of fun, a lot of fun to open up these. There's Jamal Murray. Coming on strong, Ben Simmons, and uh, old school, Paul George. And uh, 11, 12 hoops. Again, my cat has come by to say hi. If I remember correctly, uh, there's uh, Kyrie, Clay Thompson, and Kawhi Leonard in these, uh, the potential for those rookies. Through these rather quickly. John Stockton. Nice. Max Cousins and uh, Tim Duncan. Okay. Save that pack for a while. Let's just go ahead and let's get the Skybox out of Skybox out of the way. 90, 91 Skybox. Uh, when these first came out, uh, everybody was chasing after these cards. The photography was great. Um, Trying to remember, oh yeah, there's Kemp and Peyton rookies. Those are some of the bigger cards. And of course, you wanted the Jordan out of here. KJ. Dennis Johnson. Ron Harper. Sherman Douglas. Well, not much going on in that pack. We will save these. Let's go to the... Nah. Let's go ahead and open up the 1415 hoops. Uh, Giannis wouldn't be bad out of here. I'm trying to think, uh, there's some parallel cards. I don't remember too much of the rookie class. Uh, if there's anybody really that spectacular, but, uh, definitely would take a Giannis out of here. What is that? His uh, second year card? Call us son. Here's one of my rookies. Zach Levine, the second. Rubio, Evan Turner. Jeff Teague. Gordon Hayward. Draymond, Paul George, and Meeks. Rip into the Donners here.
Hey, there's Giannis right on. That is a nice looking card. Good action photo of Giannis. Hey, that's that, that's cool. I'll gladly add that one to my collection. Steve Blake. Hey, you got a die cut here, Michael Cooper. Hey, hey, you got an auto. Right on, Michael Cooper, one of the uh, legends playing for the Lakers. Look at that. And it's a uh, short print, 20 out of 25, Michael Cooper. That That is cool. That is uh, definitely worth it right there. I love getting the old school autographs of some of the older players. Right on, right on. That was a good pack. It's like Ricky Rubio and... I don't know, there's some flash to that Ricky Rubio. And then my rated rookie is Kyle Anderson. Oh, cool. Uh, so I guess we'll open up the Stadium Club. This would have been better if it was Series 2. This is Series 1. As you probably know, Series 2 has the Bean Team inserts. <clears throat> Excuse me, as well as the Shaq rookie. But uh, if I remember correctly, you can pull the Jordan. I think Jordan was one of the early cards, if not the first card, out of the uh, stadium club. So it'd be nice to pull a Jordan. These are slightly sticking together. Hey, look at Matumbo. Right on, member's choice Matumbo. Again, my PC. I have quite a few of these cards, but it's always nice to pull one of his. Just really like Matumbo the way he, uh, I don't know, just like the way he played the game. And, you know, he's a good guy off the court as well. Uh, has done a lot to uh, help out, to help a lot of people. So I really respect Dikembe. Check out that Magic. Magic Johnson there. It's a cool card. And Gary Payton. What's fun about this collectible card box is, you know, for some of you older collectors like myself, it really brings you back, you know, when you were collecting as a child or as a teenager, um, which, you know, brings back some fun memories of cards that you were chasing back then. So, I'm enjoying these. Now, I anticipate this, uh, well, they're, they're not really, I was going to say I anticipate these guys sticking together, but uh, they're not. Uh, there's Parrish, Keith Jennings. And again, uh, we would like to find a shack out of here, Kevin Brooks. Hey, there's a uh, Alonzo Morning rookie. He was one that definitely you'd be chasing. Definitely wanted to get Shaq back in the day, but if you got a Alonzo, you wouldn't be mad. Jeff Turner. You got a checklist and Don McLean. Played a little while for the Nuggets. 1617 Prestige, uh, Siakam, Ben Simmons, Jamal Murray. That's the draft class. I'm sure I'm forgetting somebody there. Uh, looks like Siakam cards are starting to, well, have been gaining a lot of steam. So I should, sure wouldn't mind pulling one of those. Isaiah Thomas, I think he was a year earlier, maybe two. Marcus Cousins. Yeah, that's a good looking stuff. Blake Griffin and Deontay Hayes or Davis. All right. Final two packs. I will save the 89 basketball, Fleer basketball. Open up the 91-92. Be awesome if I pull the Mutombo uh, auto out of here. There's also the Dominique Wilkins uh, autographs as well. But uh, I've never pulled one of those Matumbo autos out of these packs, so I would love to get one. The design of these uh, <laughs> Fleer, uh, not the best. You may argue with me, but they're they're kind of they kind of clash. I don't know. Not the best looking card, but uh, there's some definitely some good names. Carl Malone, he was a good ball player. And final pack, eighty nine. Clear. Definitely want the Jordan out of here for the Jordan sticker. Uh, of course, Scotty Pippen would be really nice. We'll just look at the sticker. It is Carl Malone. And uh, yeah, it's a good looking card. We'll gladly take that Carl Malone. 
saw Chris Mullen on the back. There's Clyde the Glide, Drexler, Theus, McFray, James Worthy, Elijah Wan and Drexler. What a good looking card. Come on, Jordan. Robert Reed. Byron Scott. Fat Waver. And Paul Presley and Chris Mullen. Well, I didn't get the Jordan, but hey, can't complain. Pulled some really nice cards, including that Jordan hologram and the Michael Cooper uh, autograph, uh, short print, as well as the Giannis and the Shaq McDonald's. Hope you enjoyed this. Uh, if you do, uh, give me a like, and uh, if you can, follow, and always comment. So, love to hear what you collect. Again, well, thanks for watching, and y'all uh, take care.